Hello and in this video I'm going to show you how to create an account on BandLab. Now BandLab is an online sequencer or DAW, Digital Audio Workstation. Now you can use these sequencers or DAWs to make music on your computer. And the first thing you have to do is make an account and log in. So that's what we're going to do. You have to use Google Chrome and we're going to be using laptops. So the first thing, get Google Chrome installed on your laptop and then go to the first page where you look for the browser. Now we search for BandLab into your search engine. BandLab, here we go, like that. It will come up in the list and here it is. BandLab, make music online. So you go to here and you get this first page and have a look at this quite interesting it tells you you can use it on your smartphone or in your tablet we can do mastering we've got loops that we can make music with lots of things that you can look at there so but what we want to do is we want to sign up so you go up here top right big button sign up and we type in your name so we'll just type in your name so now i'm just putting a test email address test at UK and a password. Now I suggest you use something really straightforward like BandLab as your password, then we know what it is. And sign up. Take a minute. It's asking you to save that. Now you want to use a username. Now we can just use whatever you, we want here, but something to do with the school that you're working with would probably be better. So for example, your name Falmouth, not like that. Okay, and then carry on. And it asks you now, which musical journey are you on? So we are an artist because we're not a social musician yet. We're not a fan. So we choose artist, continue. Tell us more about yourself, what kind of music you like playing. So we'll just start off with just a drummer, I'm a bass player, I'm a vocalist, blah, blah, blah. Beat maker, and then continue and then pick your favorite genres so genres are types of music so rock for example pop hip-hop classical country all these different types of music and then you come into the feed and this is the first sort of page it's a bit like a social media page where you have um, information about people who've released tracks and all the rest of it and the next thing you want to do is you want to press the create button up here and now this takes you to the mixer proper and we're going to leave that video here and in the next video we're going to orientate ourselves around BandLab.